We know hope you acting like we got control over who gets chosen. I think it's a joke. The president's some dope, different coat. He's just a puppet of Patsy, taking orders from a boat to the mast. He was dancing with the devil, so we can't ever trust. You got us by the ball, power, blood, money, and lust. Just take control of yourself. You know that change is a must. The initials of the U.S. is us. Before you join the military, see what the war's about. We got a lot of dirt to clean in our house. President committed treason. It's the reason we stand and we fight through the darkness and the light. The government lies. Soldiers died in the fire of war. They got burnt. They had to learn the hard way. The freedom isn't free, so they paid the price with their life. And now you miss them. Some are still missing. This ain't the Christian coalition. I'm a child of the earth. They study this knowledge without a need of a church. Of course, I thank the Lord, but no thank you for the war. All of what we fighting for is the rich against the poor. Missiles flying overhead, bodies coming home dead. I just closed the fucking window. Going down the window like a cascade. It looks like it's snowing out. Yeah. So a little bit of lightning. Alright. We're over on ecave.com. The Illuminati's book page, I guess, if you will. This is how their this is how their kids are raised. How their kids are taught in school. So right now we're talking about a, a woman's touch, relationship success support. And I was telling you how uh, they're talking about the incredible things that just the touch of a woman could do for a man. Let's see. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. I'm not really sure which one of these it is. I'm pretty sure I know what it is, but let's take a look at them anyways. First ones are intimacy personality. Jealousy personality. And in between there, how to say I love you. Relationship success support. The receiving side of jealousy, communication development and jealousy, why we become obsessed when we meet someone new, why obsession takes over when meeting someone new, looking for the perfect partner, when your imagination clashes with reality. <laughs> There's a lot of them. Uh, see, I lost my spot already. Let's just start with when love divides us. Uh, did I just turn it around? What the fuck? I see. I hate that. Anywho, when love divides us, when our eyes wander, part one and two, wandering eyes collecting fantasies, wandering eyes practical support. Relationship reactions, reaction dimension, experience dimension, physical resistance, relationship fantasies. Who does my relationship make me? Why is it so difficult to find love? Uh, it really isn't. It's What's difficult is <laughs> the coming together. <laughs> the finding. Uh... I mean, it's not it's not hard to love somebody. You could love somebody for a lot of different reasons. Uh, commitment. There's one everyone should take a look at. I remember fucking high school. It was like it's like a contest to see who could get, who could go out the most girls at the weekend. It was fucking pathetic. All the guys used to pretend like they went, they were going skating. Yeah, going skating my balls. None of them knew how to skate for a fucking lick. They just went there for the women. I went there for the music. <laughs> Fuck the bitches. Experience dimension. Okay, physical resistance. Relationship fantasies. Commitment. Fear of commitment. Why the wrongs before the right. And relationships compromise self-integrity. Relationship system. Another good one. 
Lost in the mind. Relationship system, yeah, that's a good one. Sexual attraction. The frustrations <laughs> of sexual attraction. Um, sexual desires. Should I be doing this in a low, like Howard Stern voice or something? Oh boy. Natural, natural sexual expression. Sexual frustration. Uh, which is the fucking point I'm at right now. Um, threesome fantasies. <laughs> Mind the games. Facing desire in relationship. Resisting sex. You hold me back. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure for the uh, resisting sex one, it pretty much boils down to um, read the Bible. Think of God. That's the Illuminati saying that. Uh, and for guys who support so much fucking evil, you gotta ask yourself, they, they sure do fucking study a lot of God stuff, don't they? <laughs> I just wanted on Quinky Dinks. You hold me back. Fighting over spilled milk. Damn it. Communication is key. Communication. Oh, I don't want to get that fucking song in my head. Magical relationships. Alcohol and new relationships. <laughs> <laughs> Understanding your wants, emotional dependency, intensity, the hope trap. Oh, that's a bad one. Great expectations, which is what I got a fucking problem with uh, every time. Uh, small expectations. Flirting, understanding flirting, which I highly suggest all you women take a look at. Because you got a big fucking problem with that. Um, commitment anxiety. You've heard of that before. Never ending conflict. The best and the worst. Change for the best. It's, hey, it's like the same, the same problem I have my last girl, man. You, uh, like, the, it's, there's no problem between us. The, the only reason we're having the problem is because of the, all the fucking bills. And the different hours that our work schedules were getting switched around. And so it was none of our doing. So you see, it was neither of our faults. That's why they play this little fucking game. And that's why I don't play it anymore. I don't play it. Folks, I'd rather be fucking homeless than working a fucking job like that. At least when I'm homeless, I can still get this shit out. We're supposed to be working two days a week, folks, and living like kings right now. Everyone on the fucking planet. Are we? It seems like every fucking country is going broke. What another one of those big fucking coinky days. <sighs> Cohabitation. It's not that hard, man. Oops. When you flirt with someone else. Well, t that's where the part of going to read this shit comes in very handy. So that you both understand what flirting is. Not what flirting is to you. What the fucking definition is. I mean, I wouldn't consider, you know, a hug, flirting. How the hug is taking, though, I may interpret it a little different. So, the probably the best thing to do would just be don't, just not hug, right? <laughs> uh, let's keep in mind common sense, and let's keep in mind... Fluoride poisoning. Speaking of hugging, relationship success. Hugging. Walking through resistance of hug to hugging. 
physicality of hugging. Here's the touch part. Uh, I'm not ready for a relationship. <laughs> I'm just waiting. <laughs> yeah, I'm just waiting to hear that one. Uh, that's it, 81? Creating balance and change. Yeah. Creating relationship. And here it is, last one. And, uh, I mean, you can, if you want, you can go and look it up, or, uh, yeah. So here we are over on psychology today. The surprising power of a woman's touch. Research finds fascinating effects from even the slightest connection. Just, I just read the meat and potatoes of it. So uh, the researchers found that participants who were touched on the shoulder felt more secure and took bigger risks than those who weren't, but only if they were touched by a woman. And the effect was stronger for the touch than a handshake, but disappeared entirely for participants who were touched by a man. Uh, the same finding was found for men and women who were touched by a woman, suggesting that it's not a sexual attraction, at least not solely. The researchers draw a line between this finding. Well, did they do the same thing with the man and the fucking with the men? I mean, folks. I don't know. Maybe just me here. Common fucking sense. Uh. It's called motivation. Yeah, we pick each other up. We move each other forward. That's why we're supposed to be here for each other. That's why the saying goes, there's someone for everyone. Unfortunately, that is not true in this fucking world. And so any of this stuff, I mean, first of all, I don't believe in psychology at all. All it is is fucking following trends. That's it. This just confirmed so much for me. I would suggest uh, going to, you know, some more stuff over here. Hands in scripture. There's a lot. There's a lot more stuff in there. I'm, I'm sure I'm I'm sure I, I probably didn't even show what I wanted what I did the whole fucking video for I don't know uh, That's it